Today, I'm gonna find out what happens to your matchmaking if you die for two hours straight. You see, I've tried this before where I died for one hour in a row, but after posting it, some of you pointed out that I might need to miss all of my shots and try for a couple hours. So I loaded back in again to find out just how bad matchmaking is. I kept to a couple simple rules. Die within the first minute and deal some damage, but stay under 100 overall. One hour in, I was doing a good job staying on task. <laughs> I'm just spinning in circles at this point. The players in my lobby were slowly becoming worse and worse. I neared the end of my second hour and I thought that I'd finally cracked the secrets of matchmaking until something happened that I didn't expect. I found myself in a demon lobby. <laughs> Wait, why is there a 4k 20 bomb player in my lobby? I literally have a zero KD right now. After I died, I realized that 4B was also in my lobby. I'd spent nearly two hours of my life at this point dying in Apex just to get put in a lobby with one of the best movement players in the world. Good luck out there. 